record. So according to some new poll, Barack Obama is the most trusted political leader in the world. The poll surveyed 20,000 residents of many nations, including even Macaw, a country consisting only of birds. Really? Yes. So while this proves Obama is a citizen of the world, still his own country is left wandering and confused like an open-robed granddad. I suppose it's easy, however, for Macaw to swoon over Obama. They aren't faced with cap-and-trade, nationalized health care, and those new curly light bulbs. But then again, in Macaw, I guess you're just happy to have any kind of light bulb, even if it's a candle shape like a light bulb. Oh, I kid the macaws, crazy bird people. But this poll <laughs> might mean something if Obama took advantage of it. I mean, what's the use of being loved if you can't force those who love you into submission? I mean, our prez sat on the sa sidelines with a bloody Iran, but then grows his spine over an abducted Honduran politician in pajamas. A trulier, however, would know that it's not the leaders, but the people who matter. It makes me wonder about his priorities. Does Obama make a list of things that piss him off? And if so, what's at the top? Is it fascism or poorly inflated tires? The murder of innocent protesters or teen smoking? Nukes pointed at Hawaii or sugary sodas at high school? Our nation's prosperity or his abs? I don't know, which is why, at least for now, I'm taking down my Obama poster from above my bunk bed and replacing it with a Sarkozy. He's got abs and balls. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> I'll just say one word. Hey, uh, Mr. Proopsie, if you were as popular as Obama, what would you do? I'd do exactly what he's doing. I would bask in my own self-basting, self-enchanted pixie glory. Uh, <laughs> I, I saw him say on TV once, uh, people think I'm cool. And it's like, you know what? I have a little rule. If you have to tell people people think you're cool, you're not that cool. <laughs> <laughs> How dare like you? The annoying, he's kind of like the annoying drunk at the end of the bar who won't stop, except he's not that drunk. <laughs> hey, you know, so Mike, he's always on point. Yeah. yeah. You know, Mike, you're a I'm popular sorry, Shiraz. Guy. And often the annoying drunk at the end of the bar. Yeah. <laughs> but that's, yes, you know, your popularity didn't stop you from meddling in foreign affairs and no. making the lives of foreign peoples miserable. No, not at all. And, 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 and quite frankly, the